Hello, lovelies. We're back. Well, I'm back anyway. Rusty's actually working today. Um, yeah, it's been a heck of a week. I uh, don't know if I dry. I did drop a regular video, but that was filmed prior to this week. Yeah, it's been like, you know, hazing week, I guess, at college. Pretty, pretty rough. Um, as most of you know, if you, uh, for our, our sweet Freya uh, passed away on Monday night. And um, very suddenly, with I, it's like a heart attack, aneurysm, blood clot, whatever. So she passed Monday. Of course, Tuesday we we had a nice burial service for a cat. Uh, and then yesterday, today's Thursday morning. Uh, yesterday, um, I'm very proud of myself that I was able to drive. Uh, two hours one direction to Corning Animal uh, compa Companion Animal Emergency Hospital and take a cat there for um, testing and was potential a an emergency surgery delicate surgery which did not take place that's a good thing it may have to take place but uh, they're gonna try something else and uh, perhaps start chemo or radiation. I'm not sure which one of those and see if they can, um, the, the tumor is huge, growing very aggressively and right at the larynx throat, uh, surrounding the throat. So at this point, the cat is able to eat, drink, does not appear to be in any pain, but it's so aggressively growing that things have to be done ASAP. Okay, so that's been my week, and today's Thursday. And I did order, I said I would never do this, but in light of, um, I knew this other cat was gonna probably need some surgery stuff and, and money stuff, so I only bought one of the Mary Maxim bags because it was 25% off, and that pays for shipping and a little, so I did indulge on that. I know I don't need any more yarn, um, but we will maybe get to opening this, but I did want to, yeah, actually I'm going to drop this hopefully today because I did want to kind of remind you Saturday, uh, if it all works out that we can get it together by then, we're going to have that auction. Um, and yeah, the monies goes to the mental health and meows for things like this trip all the way to this expensive uh, animal hospital. It's one of the best in the country, I think, Cornell. So, you know, if you got to go there, it's a little more expensive, but anyway, whatever. Um, so before I open up Mary Maxim, I just want to show you and, and tell you what some of the things are that are going to be in the auction. One will be, what have I got three bags here? All right, oh, I guess I was deciding between these two because they're kind of similar. Uh, two of those beautiful wrap skirts. This one is very, very uh, brown, very brown, very muted colors. There's some orange, but it's very subtle. It's basically a green brown on a brown brown. And I thought that might be more appealing to some people that don't want, like I'm going to, I would wear something totally flamboyant, uh, but not everybody's that type. So this is very muted and um, brown. And then in case, you know, for spring and the summer, you may want something a little lighter, but still very soft. So you got a green on another green with some beautiful flowers. This has the elephants and the birds. I really haven't looked into what is the meaning behind those. And to be honest, I, I don't really care. They're pretty, that's all that matters. All right, I, I was gonna throw two bags with this and I think I grabbed three because I wasn't sure. This one doesn't really go. So let's see. I kind of liked this gold one. You, we're not going to find ones that actually match the skirts. It, it's just not going to happen. But I thought this one was really pretty. Again, I try to stay a little more muted. This is very gold and shiny. And then you have some black with some design. That's your pocket. A little 
Kelly Green or Hunter Green bottom strip. The back again is very muted with just a little design. So you could wear it this way if you like, if, if you don't even, you know, if, if that's even a little too wow for you. Um, it, if you if you do win this, then if you would like a brighter pocketbook or something, we can talk about that. So it doesn't have to necessarily be these. I just happened to grab these. I thought this was pretty because it kind of balances both. You've got a nice tiny little pattern, a wow pocket, not too wow, and um, it's like a cream color. So that's one thing that's going to be, this will be auctioned as a set. And again, if, if those didn't work for you, we can work on that. And I'm just having fun with my, uh, my new, <laughs> uh, what is it? It's called a uh, fan. Yeah, hello. Alrighty, so, oh, also to, just really quickly, I want to say to uh, Cindy, Lulu's uh, Treasure Trove, had a wonderful time at your, your party. Um, and your, I, I, ha, I owe you a prize, a gift or whatever. I, I will mail it out to you. I have not been able to get to the post office. Obviously we've got some craziness going on here and being that we're having the auction on Saturday, I'm going to hopefully be able to go Monday to the post office and one trip and mail out, um, your item, Yolanda, I have your, your little package, your little thank you package. Actually, Yolanda, I'm sending her a little package because she's been binge watching all of the chant, all the, the uh, videos and like leaving comments. I'm like, girlfriend, you know, cha-ching, watch hours and just really beautiful comments. So not a giveaway, just a, hey, this is a little thank you, Yolanda, for, for being so supportive. And I've done that in the past to a lot of you never mentioned it, just sent it out. Okay. So, um, and I, I think there's a few other things. I'm still waiting for Viviana to contact me. She was a winner of the hidden giveaway that was in the winning video of the other giveaway. I'm a sneak, right? So anyway, I'm waiting for Viviana to contact us. Okay. Other things that'll be in the auction are a huge pride box, pride rainbow box, at least one. But this particular one that I'm speaking of has the bod cat stitch rainbow wrap that I made. And it's either six or eight feet long, one of them, because I made two. And then there's all kinds of other stuff in this box. So that box I'm hoping to generate some cha-ching because there's a lot of stuff in there. I may be doing another pride box. It'll have different things. I do have two of those cat wraps, so you never know. But uh, it'll be a mystery, but I'm going to uh, probably offer another Pride Rainbow box, okay? Because that's how we roll here. And there's going to be a box that is mystery yarn, but it's going to be very Americana. So look out for red, white, and blue if you want to get started on your July 4th stuff. Uh, there'll be red, white, and blue yarn in that. Um, and I will probably have some other yarn box give mystery boxes. I haven't yet gone through my shawls and ponchos and th things that I have made. I might throw a few things of items that I've made. I didn't think of ever that before, but I know how much I'm appreciating receiving items that you all have made. Then maybe I'll offer some items that I've made. You might be interested. If not, I'll just put them back in their perspective little spots. Also, D Dee from Dee's Creative Hands Crochet, she's going to be offering a, a box of her beautiful, amazing mystery yarn boxes. So that'll be cool. Marie Chavez, love you, Marie. Um, I have a shawl by her. There's, there's a few items of hers that I'll try to get the pictures and upload them on something. And I also have a box of wool, mystery wool. There'll be Hanks in there. It's going to be a little smaller of a box, but wool, you know, there's, it, it's, it's a nice box of wool. So that's all separate for you wool, non-wool sensitive people. Okay. Another thing I'm, I'm putting in here, um, again, this, I, I, this particular bag I happen to love, but it's very earthy. You've got a shimmery, a taupey browns in there and there's designs. So this is really nice. And that's your pocket. So you got another silk bag. 
again, if you want something brighter, I could do it. I just thought this is really pretty. A set of those Opri scissors. I mean, come on. One, two, three, four, five. Five scissors in here. It's a beautiful kit that'll be included. And the art kit with the, you've got the, the, I love this eraser. This is that like silly putty eraser that's like magic. And then you get smudges, you've got your smudge sharpener, regular eraser, pencil sharpener, cray paws. There's a bunch more in there. And then the entire set of coloring pencils. And if you have this, you probably would love a coloring book, which is beautiful cats. Very mystical. This is really, these, these, this company makes fabulous coloring books. Look at that, owls and butterflies. And that's in honor of our Freya. I'd like to pass that on. And then also, Jewel Tone Soft Fun. Soft Fun is what they're called. It's a, uh, let's see, 12 Soft Fun 20 gram, 3.5 to 4 millime millimeter. I'm assuming that's a hook. 20 gram equals yada, yada, yada. It's 60% catoine. I'm going to just do this. Do you see that? Is it focusing? Because I don't know how to pronounce that. And acrylic. I don't see where it's saying how many yards. They're cute though, aren't they? And all jewel tones, because I know you ladies love those jewels tones. <laughs> okay, so that's something else that's going to be in. This will be in one package. And there might be more stuff, but I did want to include these. So this is going to be a nice gift. And like I said, there may be more. I might throw a fan in there. Who knows? All right, so that's basically what some of the stuff. There'll be more stuff, but I, I, I know I'm running late on these, and the, the thing is going to be in a short while, a couple days. It's just been tough. All right, so let's open up and see what we've got. I love you, Mary Max, some mystery bag. Uh, I'm trying to do it without the... Not that you don't all know my address, but... Yes, I have had people send... Oh, I did it, didn't I? I have had people send stuff to my post office box or our post office box. I just haven't gotten there yet, so please, um, I will go there Monday. And thank you in advance for your kindness and your generosity because there is no need to send me stuff, really. I like it, but you don't have to. All right. Eh, oh well. All right, so we've got four more of the Caron Simply Soft. I did only order one this time. I see something I'm happy about. But I do have lots of this, the Caron Simply Soft, because I think the last bag didn't have them. But they have had them pretty much in every bag. And I have asked people if they really want some. I can do something with them if they want to pay shipping or whatever. All right, what do we've got? What is this? So we do have those. This is actually very pretty. Burnett Softy Baby, pink, blue, and purple. I'm digging it. That's really pretty. And it's 100% acrylic, very, very soft, three weight. And if I could find the yardage, up oh, here it is, 310 yards or three, uh, 283 meters. And the colorway on this is Spring Flowers. That's nice. That's perfect for, actually, we got spring around the corner. And interesting. Okay. It's green. I love the color green. Can you see that? I don't have any lights on. This is slipper and craft yarn. Cool. And there's a free pattern on the label to make these really cool slippers. It's the... Um, like tape yarn type stuff, but it's thin. That's really cool. But it's a pattern. Short slippers. I'm trying to see if it's crochet or knit. I don't know. I don't see. Okay, there's 164 yards. 
and it's deep green is the colorway, but that is, that's cool. I, I don't even think I've seen this on their site. So that's something new and interesting. This is awesome. Caron Simply Soft, and they have two, uh, 200, 200, yes, yeah, speak much, 235 yards, 215 meters. It's a four weight. This is camouflage, greens, brown, black. Yes. And the color is Renegade Camo. Yeah, I like this. Keeping that. Sorry, folks. The other ones, this stuff here, I don't care. And look what's in. Well, let's first look at this. Peyton Patton. I wanted to say hamster, but it's hempster. I've been buying their hemp yarn. I like their hemp yarn. And this is perfect. Again, I'm keeping it. Sorry. But um, I like the hemp yarn because I've been using this for drawstrings. And it would be perfect for pocketbook handles because it's super sturdy. And this was expensive. And, I, and gray is perfect because gray goes with everything. Almost everything. And there's a 190 yards in each. It's a three weight. And the colorway, if I could find it, is pewter. That makes logical sense. But look what's in the bottom. So these two, those things I'm keeping. These things I don't care. More purple glimmer. Oh my gosh. I think Mary Maxim knew it was me and threw this bag in here. Just because I've been buying the hemp yarn, love the camo, and I always need more shiny glimmer purple Mary Maxim you're the best, Mary Max. I'm really seriously. Okay. So, and I'm not, I'm not an affiliate. I'm none of that. I don't get anything for free. I pay for everything. I, I'm just saying that because I feel that way. And it's deep purple. That was a very good band back in the day. Alrighty. So those are going to go in. There's an actual section in my room for just glimmer yarns. And we've got a baby blanket out of shells. A basket that's very pretty and it looks like the basket has handles I like that that's probably for the hemp yarn this looks super soft it's a beginner skill I might uh, keep this is it crochet circular knitting yeah yeah bums um, I might keep this anyway because I might uh, I want to learn how to knit I may or may not I don't know all right, if I'm going to start knitting, I'm going to do something simple like a blanket because it's just back and forth. And here is for the uh, sugars and cream, which, hey, we didn't get scrubby. This definitely, Mary Maxim must have known because they sent, they didn't send scrubby. This, I think, is really ultimately cool. And I wear slippers all the time because I'm always in my pajamas. Um, but I might put that in a bag a thing so this is dishcloth and and the basket that's nice that is a very good idea because I do the dishcloths and all that but I'd never thought of crocheting a basket to fold your dishcloths in ha smart yarn inspiration all righty that was a yarnalicious box speaking of yarn oh somethings all righty I guess that's it I'm stoked like I said these items here I am keeping because they're definitely ones that I will use. Oh, by the way, I did get a new bathrobe, and you probably have seen me in it, the gray and navy blue stripe. And I said I wouldn't, but I did not throw the old bathrobe out. So these, this is so soft. These I'm keeping. These items here will go somewhere to one of y'all. Um... So I'm kind of tossing this around because I really like that concept. They're really cool slippers. All right, guys. I love you. I've been keeping you too long. This was a little bit long, but it was a happy video. And hey, don't forget, Saturday, 8 p.m. p.m. at um, right after D's Creative Hand Crochets. At, it's an Eastern Standard. Yes. All right. This is what you get when you just try to talk with too many thoughts in your head. 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. This Saturday, February 18th, it will be two days prior to my 25th again birthday. My birthday is actually the 20th. I will be 63 years old. I did not, up to this point, celebrate birthdays, but now that I'm at that point, I'm going to start celebrating them again 
because each time I make another birthday is worth a celebration. Okay. And in saying that, I'm going to say goodbye, lovelies. Be well. Don't forget thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. Oh, yeah, we did not make the 1,500 subscribers, and that's only a couple days. We're, we're under 100 short, and that was that amazing giveaway. So if you want to shout us out and whatever, try to get us there, that's great. If not, no biggins. You know, I'll have that giveaway at some other time. Or maybe put that in the auction box. All right. Love you guys. Be well, be happy, and be oh, fabulous. Hey, guys. Bye.